Wait, she tripped on her Manolo? Stanny, the girl died. It's sad. The end. I'll say it's sad. The scandal of the New York social scene, and I missed it. I need details. Last words. I'm so bored, I could die. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Hey, hi. Hey. hey. This funeral is better than Fashion Week. I know. Marcus is saving us seats next to Hugh Jackman. I'll see you in there. I didn't know Lexi had so many friends. Well, she wasn't always so tragic. Remember the 80s? She was the it girl. I thought I was the it girl. Well, it's your word against a dead girl, so you win. You guys, we're supposed to be in mourning. We are. It's the end of an era. Yep, the party's officially over. Ladies, if you are single in New York, after a certain point, there is nowhere to go but down. 18 stories down, to be exact. I'm going to Paris. <gasps> That's so exciting! <laughs> Good for you! <laughs> because you're afraid of going out a window? No, because I want to open a new one. What about your job? I quit. What? When did you stop? We are done with the question portion of the program. I'm happy. I'm going. Now let's go say goodbye to Lexi. Well, it really is the end of an era. After the funeral, a couple of friends walked a couple of blocks. You want to go get something to eat? Well, I'm not hungry, but I'll go sit with you. OK. Isn't Gordon's around here? It's two blocks. I can't believe you quit your job. Couldn't you write the column there? No, they weren't really into my American girl in Paris angle. You know, New York paper, New York girl. It got to be such a hassle, so. Huh. Are they going to have someone new write in, or? Don't know. Probably some 29-year-old single girl with all new problems. I think you're making a mistake. Miranda, please. Carrie, you can't quit your column. It's who you are. No, it's not who I am. It's what I do. That's my column. You know, I think I should go home. What? I'm not allowed to have an opinion? You have an opinion. You've had it for quite some time. What are you going to do over there without your job? Eat croissant? Why can't you be happy for me? I'm sorry, but I don't understand why you have to move away and give up your life. You move to Brooklyn? That's just Brooklyn. I cannot stay in New York and be single for you. What? This is about you. As long as I'm here in the same place, writing my column, then nothing has really changed. No, this is about you. No, you moved on, Charlotte's moved on, even Samantha's moved on. I can stay here and write about my life, or I can go with him and live my life. You mean his life? Carrie, I love you. Come on. Just say it. You don't like him. Fine, I don't like him. Then don't you go to Paris with him. You're living in a fantasy. Maybe I was living in a fantasy, but I found a man who could make it a reality. And I wasn't going to question any of it. Not even how he found a horse-drawn sleigh in the middle of Manhattan.